My name is Sophie Thurling. I'm playing Emily Beckman in The Faceless Man. Um, I've been acting for about seven years, uh, on and off to begin with, and then uh, probably for the past four years I've been taking it seriously. But um, yeah, I've worked on a range of things, short films, uh, music videos, voiceover work, feature films, commercials, bit of everything really. And it's, uh, yeah, it's been a, been a long ride, that's for sure. It's interesting because I actually didn't apply for an audition for The Faceless Man. Um, so Peter Flattery, uh, who's also in the, in the, uh, in the film, uh, recommended me for the role of Nina originally. Uh, so I uh, yeah, got called in and I came in and I had about two days to kind of prepare for my audition. And uh, yeah, I went in and went through the script and then they asked me to do a read through of Emily and then that was Emily. So <laughs> that's how that happened. Emily is an interesting character to play. Um, this genre of film, so your horror, thriller, I haven't done a lot of. Um, and she's definitely different to other characters I've played in the past. Um, uh, you know, she suffers from, she, she's been ill before, earlier in, in the film. Um, and it's had a very negative effect on her. I don't want to give too much away, but I'm just, it's a, it's a different uh, mindset than any other character I've ever played. Yeah, well, I think, uh, I mean, the Australian film industry, we seem to do a lot of uh, true stories. We love our true stories in the Australian film industry. You know, you've got things, uh, uh, they, you know, we talk about Ned Kelly a lot or Ben Hall recently. You know, there's all the underbelly files. And I think something like this, something so creative um, and that's not a drama, or, or a comedy, it's, it's something completely different. I think that's going to really shine throughout the Australian film industry and I think it's going to, I think it's going to do quite well.